am going to give you a list of the best tools to help you grow here on YouTube as a content creator. What's going on everyone? This is all tech savvy. Welcome to the another video. If you are new here, consider subscribing. So let's begin. On number 5, Adblock Plus. So Adblock Plus is one of the most popular Google Chrome extension lets you clean your web pages by removing those clumsy advertisements from sidebars and everywhere else. The free plugin can block various kinds of ads such as animated ads, pop-ups and pop-under, Facebook ads, etc. Also, there is an impressive level of protection from tracking and malware. The savvy users can choose additional block list as well as set of custom filter or wish list. On other hand, there is a set of acceptable ads that do not interrupt you from web browsing. Plus, this is an open source extension is customizable as well. Number 4 is Hardbit. Hardbit is just a useful tool, basically it allows you to manage a lots of your comments, the global chat to meet a new friends and then you can also, this is another key things here is to add on a click YouTube icon for video manager, analytics and comments so that it is really nice out there and in the terms of video you can get a room here. All the video tags, video edge and you can copy a YouTube annotation to your video. So it is just useful tools for a lots of YouTubers out there. We do use it as you can see and I also recommended you to install this extension. So on number 3rd is Social Blade. First thing you need to know is Social Blade is a statistical YouTube extension. Anyone that has, that has at least 5 subscribers can get entered in the system. We can track our channel every single day. As a result of this what you can do is you can put your channel in and you can get a quick health check of your channel. Add a box to the right side of the video you are watching on YouTube showing the most IMP statistics from Social Blade about. On the YouTube page, you can watch on the right hand side the total overview of the user ID such as total grade, overview rank, video view rank, which network he has claimed, how estimated money he earned, subscriber last 30 days, daily sub average, subscriber subs today, on the right portion, view last 30 days, daily view average, the view today and the bottom, you can also watch that the tags put on the video and on the bottom of that, you can also watch that the view more on the social blade and on the right and say the live subscriber count also we can watch on this uh, same page on number two is vidIQ first you have to go to the chrome app store and download the both vidIQ for chrome and vidIQ vision for youtube chrome extension that will pop a little button into your chrome browser which means you are ready to roll once you install this vidIQ extension onto your chrome browser you will start noticing some interesting things so let's start with a standard youtube page right side of the portion of the screen display the vidIQ scorecard this is a snapchat breakdown how well the video is performing best on the all sort of the data such as view per hours likes engagement and estimated earning and so on underneath that is a list of the all tags in the video is using and how well the rank on the top searches. It is a great way of finding out what tags you can use on your video. You will also want to start clicking on the IQ button that will be dotted around the screen. This provide you with helpful tools and more on them little more. Back on the vidIQ scorecard you will find a tab that will show you who sharing your video and where they shared. vidIQ can also put a every single video on YouTube under his microscope but it can also offer an interesting insight into a millions of video on a single page if you search for the terms on YouTube. VidIQ will also again park itself on the right side of the screen where you can see just how popular that not only site. that but it will also tell you how competitive word is. If it is a good work to use it will also offer you an alternative search item volume of the search item. The best news is the VidIQ will help you to apply these tags in the terms of your video in individual and the both scale. When you are not on the YouTube, the vidIQ Chrome extension button become your home. Not only does it include the all important links to your YouTube page, it is a your gateway to vidIQ own web application.
Here you will find it is a get a more analytical tools to help a YouTube more effectively. This include the data on your playlist external URL that links to your YouTube video and even the best time to post a new video based on the subscriber activity. So just take it easy and install this extension. The beauty of TubeBuddy is that nearly all our tools are built directly into YouTube's website. After installing the TubeBuddy plugin, you'll find our main menu in the top corner of every page. It offers quick links to common areas on YouTube, important notifications, how-to videos, and a place for you to suggest new ideas. Most of our tools can be accessed on a few main areas of YouTube. On the My Videos page, you'll find a drop-down menu next to each video with a categorized list of tools, as well as a menu above the video's list with bulk processing options. On the Upload screen, you'll find a variety of tools to help automate and streamline your pre- and post-publishing process. On any Info and Settings screen, you'll find inline video optimization tools as well as the General Tools menu. On Video Watch pages, We've added additional tabs to the description area. You can view video statistics, video tag, search rankings, as well as access many of our tools. If you head over to your account on TubeBuddy.com, you'll find more advanced monitoring and analysis tools for each of your channels. Thanks for watching. If you are not already subscribed, make sure hit that subscribe button. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time.